Do I have a volunteer to walk through the numbers with me? Does anybody feel really confident? Okay, let's go. All right, so median income was 277. No, that's the medium home price. Median home price is 277. Sorry. <laughs> that would be nice if that was the median yeah. income. <laughs> All right. So, um, so 20% of that is what? One, uh, 20% of that is 55 So the minimal requirement. <laughs> I got 221,600. Is that what everybody else got? Yep. Yes. Okay. So then, what's 20? You said it was the same number. Same, it, it, so, it is on both of your examples. So it's 55, 400, divided by 76, 824, right? Which gives you what? 1.38 something. It's 439. Did everybody get 139? Yeah. Well, 138.6. So 138.6, whatever it was. So you round up to 139, right? So I have a question for you. How many of you have buyers that have 20% to put down? Some do, right? Do 100% of your buyers have 20% to put down? So do you think that this is a realistic view of what's really going on? Because at this 139, what does that mean about affordability in your area? Homes are affordable with 20% down at the median price. So what could that tell you about your market? Where is it going? Possibly up. Possibly. Um, the, the March price was 271. Well, prices are definitely going. Really? Because the March price was 271. Because both listings I had are a lot higher than what the comps said. A lot higher. Well, the appraisals are. That's what I was coming say. The appraisals are. Appraisers right. are coming in with the same higher than the comps. So. So. Not all the time. Not all. Year to date, the I number understand. is 277, but in March it was 271. Just something. Just. Just something for you guys to know, right? If you're looking at this on a monthly basis, I mean, it took Debbie five minutes to pull these numbers. So if you're looking at this on a monthly basis, you're gonna start seeing trends, right? You're gonna start seeing the day, like you're gonna pull it month over month and see the day that the affordability number changes, right? So if we're looking at it year to date versus, it actually went up. 271, it would make it go up, right? This number would be higher. So maybe the market is going up, maybe the market's going down. It's just something for you to be aware of. Okay? But I don't think that pulling it on 20% is what you should do. So let's do the same exercise, but this time do it for 5%. Math. And then CHA us do math. I did. Well, I was trying to do a reality, which is a 2.5. Here's what I told you. 